back in, in, in 92, 93, 94, we were farming uh, part-time and uh, we were working for a firm of accountants part-time and we wanted the future a more of a challenge. So we looked at ideas, could we start something, do something different other than the two things we're doing at the moment. So we searched around for, for a long, long time looking for ideas and um, eventually um, we struggled getting ideas and eventually we came we came up with an idea maybe that our old potato shed we were selling potatoes at the time and growing potatoes as well that we could convert that um, maybe to a shop and um, we thought of the idea of maybe selling a garden center with indoor shops in a country setting the only retail ex experience we had before we opened was is that we used to sell the potatoes from the shed Okay, over 16 years but we had a bell in the shed that people would drive in from the road and they would ring the bell and we'd be up in our house because we couldn't see it and we'd ring the bell and we'd come down and serve them potatoes so that was our retail experience <laughs> before we opened <laughs> <laughs> yeah. in 94 we decided to take the plunge we sold our farm equipment and uh, we set up uh, in April uh, 94 and we invited everyone who came to the opening to have tea. Anywhere we had a space for a table, we set it out and we done loads of cooking, apple tarts, crumbles, banoffee pie, and a two-layered pavlova was the hit for the day. Weeks and weeks after that, people kept coming back to the shop that was now open and saying, it's just a pity the house is not open for the tea. <laughs> So we, were, we, we realised that the homely atmosphere is what they really wanted. And uh, it just, you know, that's where the tea room idea came out of. Everything that worked out best for us was always local and local people as well, the best and local ideas. So we developed it well, as I was saying, over the first four and five years. It grew phenomenally. Fast, I did. We're lucky that the lads were interested in it, and if they hadn't have come in, if they hadn't have had the interest, and we didn't force them into it either, that, you know, but that was the big high risk, I think, more mm. so than this session, if they had not come in to carry on and after that, you know. When we were doing potatoes, we had a field in Ra, and it was covered with stones, because this is a very granite area. And uh, Patrick always says, I always went into that field and I thought to myself, I'm on my own and I have to pick all this 20 acres of stone. But he said, I started in the middle and worked out. And that's exactly what we did during the recession. We, we just kept going. And, you know, it has worked out. It has been tough, but it has worked out, thank God. Well, it's nice to see something you built, and I suppose built in your own area, more important as well. Like, you know, you know, it's lovely to see that being passed on, but you're actually still part of it. Do you know what I mean? And you're still there, and you're still involved, and you have still a say as well. And you know, that's, 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 that's nice, like, do you know what I mean? So, you know, we're getting on the reverse now as well, and hopefully from now on, you know, we'll have more time as well, and we'll see it developing as well more and more. Like. Now, we didn't expect that we would win the best large store for 2013. Uh, and we were just so excited. It was a huge acknowledgement. It was, like, it was especially for, like, for both of us, but for James as well, because he was running it at that time, like, you know, and it was a great boost, and we're coming into our busiest Christmas time. So it was a great boost for us going forward, like what we've done. And what, so, so near the end of the recession, as it was ending up, it gave us a boost to keep going and going. You know, we knew then we had a chance, but getting to that stage and seeing the companies they were up against and seeing winning, that was a great achievement. Like, it was a great encouragement for us as well, and we mm. really enjoyed. That was one of the best nights mm. and best, wasn't it? Yeah. And we jumped around like jammies. If we did all <laughs> that. But uh, the president was there that night, and it was a big night. It was a gala night, and mm. it was, so it was. It was, it was a, great a great recognition. It was great, great recognition. recognition. We yeah. felt like God, we had done something, and we are somebody. Jammies, we've created something.